Hello, this is Professor Chicago Elmos. I'm talking today about accent reduction. I'm a professional English teacher and I have a free class in Chicago. So you can uh, contact me and find out about that. But that is uh, more English conversation rather than accent reduction. The first thing to consider when thinking about accent reduction is that generally that's not necessary. <laughs> that might come as a surprise to you. When I say generally, in certain business situations you might want to have a, a certain sounding accent rather than another kind. Uh, but uh, mostly accents are charming and everybody has one. And reducing your accent uh, should not be a goal. Accent reduction is a big business. People make a lot of money about, on it. It's kind of a hoax. However, People who have accents need to be concerned about being understood, and that might be different than accent, it's communication. Generally speaking, if you slow down and speak slow, loud, and clear, you will communicate effectively, and that it should be your goal. Uh, let me tell you a couple quick stories. I had a friend with a uh, daughter and I called up one day and I said to my friend, your daughter sounds like she's from one of the islands. <laughs> and because that's where uh, her housekeeper was from. A, um, an island in uh, wherever <laughs> and my friend says yes because my uh, because she's been spending so much time with the housekeeper and another friend that I know went to a University of Chicago and after several months there I said to her you know, you sound like you're from the East Coast now or something. Because she developed an accent by interacting with people from the East Coast. So this happens over and over again. By experiencing an environment, people develop certain accents. So it would make sense that if you want to develop an accent like somebody, you need to practice uh, t t talking the way they talk. So one suggestion I have for you is if you want to change your accent or communicate more effectively with your voice is to go to yapper.com y-a-p-p-r dot com y-a-p-p-r dot com I've recommended this before and it might sound like I'm I work for them or something, but I don't. I have a, uh, a video on there about uh, the best ways to learn English, but uh, I have nothing, no association at all with the company. But they, it's a wonderful site where you're able to watch the same video over and over again, have the English text, and have a professional say what the video is. And these are, say what's on the video. And these are like popular videos. Uh, about news and music or whatever. It's a terrific site, so I suggest that, that if you're learning English, either conversation or uh, so-called accent reduction, that you go there and, uh, and uh, use that site. So, if you think you have an accent, don't worry about it. Just go to Yapper, practice over and over again, use a tape recorder to see your changes, and you find that uh, your accent will soon disappear. 
What you don't want to do, in my professional opinion, is to have some teacher tell you about uh, different uh, syllables and sounds from a chart or blackboard. That will mess you up. That's like trying to diagram a sentence and, and think about the parts of speech while you talk. It will slow you down. People learn naturally, and repetition is good. Uh, thank you very much.